someone also asked me as far as um, being honest with yourself and figuring out what is it that you're good at, what is it that you're not. And I think as you grow your business, you really got to like check your ego out the door. And you really got to ask yourself like, I'm, I think as lawyers, we, we, we got big egos. We want to, we think we're good at everything. Yeah, you'll never hear a lawyer admit that they suck at something. It's very rare because lawyers have big egos. But as you grow your business, you really got to be honest with yourself and be like, okay, what is it that I'm excel at? What is it that I don't, I'm not very good at and um, when you scale your business you really want to just hire around those areas that you're not really good at or you really don't care for so it takes a lot of being honest with yourself about um, what kind of role you're gonna be as you grow your business um, so I know for me personally I just realized that hey I love people I love marketing um, I like being involved with the bigger cases but as far as the day-to-day -day grind and litigation I've been a lawyer for like 11 years now and I'm just over it I hate doing discovery I don't like like a bunch of other, I don't like reviewing discovery. I don't like the nitty gritty paperwork stuff. Um, I'd rather just meet the clients, take some key depositions and try a case and focus on bringing in business. So that's something I had to be honest with myself because I'm very, I can tend to want to control things and want to be involved with everything. So it's just not practical as you grow your business anymore. So you really got to start hiring and delegating. So that's one of the things I realized, be honest with yourself, figure out what it is that you suck at and delegate it out.